Hey everyone, it's uh, Scott uh, checking in again. I uh, just wanted to touch base with uh, the YouTube community. I had two views. Yay. <laughs> but uh, I'm just going to keep doing this just for myself. Um, maybe if I can do it for other people, that'd be cool too. But uh, i got to make an example of myself before I do anything for anyone else. Just wanted to update people on uh, what happened yesterday, uh, the same day that I made that last video. So I went to uh, a meeting, uh, an, an uh, AA meeting, um, who told my wife that it uh, had to be done. Um, it was, that's probably one of the hardest things to do is, is talk to one of your loved ones and say that, you know, you, you really need the help and all that. Um, there's different ways to approach the whole alcoholism thing and all that. Um, I'll show you. That. So I got this yesterday. A little AA book. And uh, one thing, because I'm a First Nations person, I've been looking at the three... I'm reading a book of 365 days of walking the red road. So, the Native American path of leading a spiritual life every day. Um, I, I tried different things in the past about the whole drinking and all that. And, uh, you know, I, I went to a place called Cam H, which is the hospital, and I did like spiritual healing, or, you know, not spiritual healing, but uh, sharing circles and all that. Um, so I'm trying to put all together different paths of what this whole sobriety is about because you know yesterday at the meeting they, they talked about hitting a little point in your, in your life and I had a few and uh, I don't know if I mentioned this but in my last video I think I said that I had one full year of sobriety so that one year of sobriety, I did military training. You know, I, I was at Saint Jean. I was at Gage Town. You know, I was I was on top of my game, and I fucked up at work. And you know, my boss told me like, Scott, you're you're slipping. Um, and he he reminded me the the person I used to be. And. You know, it, it's good. It was the first time somebody called me out on this. So, yeah. Um, that, that's pretty much, I'm just going to keep it short and sweet, I guess. Um, another thing that sucks also about alcoholism is if, if it's in your family. So, my father was an alcoholic and uh, he was a police officer. Uh, for the Toronto Police and he essentially died f I, I was told for many years that it was um, a heart attack and I recently just found out that it was actually due to delirium to, I don't know how to say it but basically like the seizures or, or whatever happens to people so I've been scared to quit 100%, so I'm going to just taper off of my alcoholism. So I, that's another thing I don't know if I mentioned, but I didn't quit 100%. I've slowly, I'm slowly tapering off, and yeah, so, oh yeah, this is the Red Road to Recovery. I think I showed that. Um, another thing, just fucking weight gain. When you don't give a shit about your life and you're drinking, you don't care. You know, I used to, when I was personal training and in the military, you know, I, I cut lean chicken press. I, I was on top of my game. And it all fucking fell apart just due to this fucking disease. And uh, today, I'm going to, like... I purchased um, a movie called The Anonymous People a little while ago, 
<clears throat> back when I had my original problems and all that, and that, that's another story I'll get into. But, um, yeah, the, the Anonymous People, the, the different books, the, the different everything is just going to help. And uh, I'm, you know, it's going to be slow. I'm going to make sure that I have progress. And um, I'm more than willing to help anybody once I actually help myself. Um, and when I say I help myself, I mean fucking literally losing the weight and getting healthy again because you know when you have that problem you know you might know it at one point you might try and move past it you might try and do this and that but it's always going to come back and bite you in the fucking ass it it you know that that's what i was talking to people about and they just said like it always comes back to hurt you so I'll cut this video short and uh, just want to let you know fucking uh, what was up, but I'm going to make another video tomorrow. And uh, by Friday, I'm probably going to have myself completely tapered off. Um, you know, and my work has been really nice. They're understanding. And, uh, you know, it's it's good but um you know the the point is i just i'm, I'm getting better and uh it's a disease that no one else can fucking understand unless you have it you don't fucking understand it so all right i'll i'll cut this one short well not short seven minutes so all right i'll see you guys later